If God were suddenly condemned to live the life he has inflicted on men, he would kill himself. The meaning of life is that it stops. So why prolong the agony? Christ, that's pretentious. To whom it may concern. Sorry for the inconvenience. P.S. Don't forget to feed the whale. Mr. Neck, that is with a K, isn't it? We've been expecting you. How was your trip? Now, let's not beat about the bush, shall we? I'm afraid we're going to have to put you through a formality. It's the usual, nothing to worry about. Really? Now, I haven't had time to go through your file yet, but we'll get to that later. We go right here. my mother. She's dead. Of course she's dead. Oh, you can say hello later. We really must get on. Are you ready? Practically. But if it wasn't for this, Jesse. Oh, oh, oh. Now, I'll tell you what's going to happen. We have got a film of your entire life. And we're going to sit here all nice and cosy with, uh, <laughs> with all of your friends and watch it. What, in front of all those people? Oh, uh, we've edited out the dull bits. It won't take more than a few minutes. Who's that? Mm. In the front row, I don't recognise him. <laughs> well? Third from the left, with the toupee. Smith! How many times have I told you, friends and relatives only, would you be kind enough to leave without making fuss? Out! <laughs> Sorry about that, Smith. Bit of a voyeur, I'm afraid. <laughs> Always creeping in. Well, I think they're ready, so shall we go and sit down? Come this way and sit here. OK, roll up. Ah, yes. This is when you were three. Uh, unfortunately, we lost the previous years, but one can assume you ran the usual gamut of dribble, piddle, puke, and poo. <laughs> ah, your first romantic encounter. that just puked up on you. She fancies you. You go out with her. Oh, my God. Is this really necessary? I am sorry. I should have explained. Here, your thoughts are public property. You see, so if nothing can be owned and nothing can be hidden, there can be no theft and no lies. 
straightforward and ever so handy, don't you think? Sounds more like hell to me. My dear sir, hell is merely a state of mind. But if this isn't hell, where is it? Well, now, it's not so much a place as a condition. You see, there really is such a thing as, well, for the sake of argument, shall we call it karma? You know, what you sow, you reap, be it good or bad. Well, now it's harvest time for you, okay? I don't believe in karma. It's a load of Buddhist claptrap. Anyway, this is just a bad dream. I can tell it's a dream because it's in black and white. Honestly, it is not a dream. You lot, you've always got to believe you're right. And anyone who disagrees with you is wrong and will die in oblivion. I mean, it's not only narrow-minded, it's... Positively rude. <clears throat> I feel like I've been cheated. Not at all. <laughs> you lot. I mean, the one hand, you can't see beyond the end of your noses. And then when you've got it in the palm of your hand, you can't even be bothered to look. A first-rate farce, I must say. Not at all funny. Oh, but I digress. Oh, I see. We have speeded forward to... Uh, <laughs> 25 already. What did you say to Ben? What did you say to me? No. Come here and say that to me. No. Come here and say that to me, you little duck. I can't no. believe that you exist. You, you are the most incompetent person I've ever met in front my of all life. These people. Oh, for goodness sake. Oh, my God. <laughs> stop. Stop the film. Leave us. The most no, incompetent person Look, in my life. You're not the only one who's had to go. I've never, never agreed with anybody this. like this you. This is private property. Will, Will you please shut up and sit I can't go round, so get away from me. Never have Never have It seems it was not meant to be. Fate must be on your side. I am sorry about this, Mr. Dick. But there's one other thing you have to do, so please compose yourself and come along. Sir. You don't have to worry, Mr. Neck. We've worked out what we're going to do with you. What did I do to deserve this? <laughs> I'm not saying a thing. What? What? What's all this? What? What are these? Who are these? What, what, what's that? What, what? What's all this water? If I'd known it was going to be like this, I wouldn't have bothered. It's hardly my fault, is it? That's it, Mr. Smarty Pants. Smart ass angel. Think you're in, don't you? Going mad. That's it. I must be going yeah. mad. What's the matter now? Going mad. I can't cope. It's all too much. Okay, Things okay, keep changing. Yes. One minute I'm here, the next I'm not. Oh my God. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Once you've been here a while, you'll get used to it. You see, here as on Earth, things keep changing all the time. But here you're in a constant state of inertia where nothing really happens. Only here one is inclined to see a little more. Because usually people see only what they want to see. It makes them feel safer. What's all that rubbish that I've seen? Do I really have to spit it out? Quite so, really. You see, now I appear to you in a way that does not intimidate or disturb you. Agree? Well, all right. I'll go along with that. But in fact, I am many faces, many bodies and ages. There are as many realities as there are perspectives. We are all part of everything. Capiche? Very clever. I bet you're a wow at parties. <laughs> well, this is where we store it all people's lives. It's alphabetical, mostly. Except for the masterpieces, of course. You know Christ, what are at that crowd. They, uh, they've got a bit all to themselves. It'll be under K for cock-up, I reckon. That's not very nice. Well, 
You must admit it was a bit of a dog's breakfast, the bits we were allowed to see. There's no need to rub it in. By the way, what does God look like? Dennis Roussos in a dirty big skirt, that sort of thing. His name is Demis. Don't be ridiculous. Stick to the subject. I thought God was the subject. <laughs> There's no need to be so pedantic. I suppose you regard me as a necessary evil. Hmm. Yes, you could say that. This is the main control room, one of many, of course. But just to give you a taster. This is more <laughs> like it. <laughs> Hello. Oh, lovely. Lovely. I could have died and gone to heaven. Thank you. Lovely angles. Well, lovely yes. angles. Lovely angles. Was it? Was it? <coughs> and I did like that tracking shot. Well, darling, I wasn't entirely convinced oh, about I that did. ending. I did. And the Pussy Barclay approach. Well, it left me wanting. 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 Yes. I want for nothing in this life. <laughs> Music for the credits. Oh, hang about. Oh, come on, come on. Hang on a minute. I can't. Hang on a minute. Can. Here. Where's that new fellow you just brought in? He should be coming up any moment. Now. Oh, look. There he is. Oh, 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 God knows. Here's the music. Music? Call that music? Muck! That's what I call that. Muck! The kind of music well, you're picking on your well, shoes. I think Cheery bit of Bartok. Oh, drop it, you big Philistine, you. It's only a suggestion. You drop your own big Philistine. 